Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another smoking session. I'm your host, Crazy Rocky, here with Jason Nova. Today we're going to be watching uh, The Strokes, The Adults Are Talking uh, live uh, from SNL. Uh, that we couldn't find, I, I don't know if this is the video, I think this is just the audio because it's just a picture showing on screen for now but maybe it goes into the video so anyway i have not seen it it was a recommendation thank you guys for the recommendations if there's anything else you want us to react to let us know in the comments below uh but let's uh jump on in here the vocals are usually low key it feels like the vocals are the main thing to draw you in and then the instrumentation is the background so i feel like they kind of flipped that on this on that on its head this time around and then uh he went and he did the powerful vocals towards the end and really switched it up and really showed his range so it did it did two things it, it allowed to show the the instrumentation in the forefront and show how good and powerful that was on its own and then he went in separately afterwards went and showed you how powerful his range one was and what he could do with his voice so i actually really really fucking like this song this one will be actually towards the yeah top of my, right uh, next to to the mask yes yeah 100 percent. yeah it's a great uh yeah it's a really good song yeah because i would have uh, like i said i would have agreed with you at the beginning because it's just like I was vibing with it because yeah. I was vibing with the fact that the instruments were controlling the melody rather than the people themselves. Yeah. Which, I, I mean, I, I know that sounds weird, but yeah. you, you get The vocals, yeah. The vocals weren't leading the track. It was more the instrumentation. Yeah, exactly. Was yeah, that's what I was saying as well, yeah. So then he changed it up towards the, uh, like, halfway through. After halfway through, he just kind of changed it up. And, yeah, it stood out to me. It just, I vibed with it even more and... Yeah, and especially because it's almost like it's almost like a, a build up in a track when you're waiting for the bass to hit, and yeah. so it almost like it built you up this whole time, and then all of a sudden it hit, and so when it hit, it was even that much more rewarding. So yeah, this song was very very well done. If there's a new album coming out, I'm gonna be very excited to see what they do. Cause uh, it's kind of like uh, Slipknot before I forget, where okay. he goes. It's like it's really heavy. It's one of my favorite songs, but I think they won actually a Grammy for it, but. The like the near like the last verse, he goes into his Corey Taylor goes into his softer tone, and it just the switch up makes this track fucking unbelievable. With, with this, it's the same thing. Yeah, no, I 100% feel that. Yeah, there's always something when you can show the juxtaposition of two parts of a song. It just makes it feel more fulfilling, a more filled out, you know what I mean? It definitely, yeah, it shows ranges and shit. So, yeah, and and, it, and also in in this one in particular, it made it very psychedelic as well because you're vibing with the thing the whole time and then all of a sudden it kicks you. And I could, I could see it in a trip as if I were, like, if I were to close my eyes during a trip, how the visuals would play out on that. And it would probably be pretty fucking sick. So, you know, this would be a great song to trip to. Yeah. yeah but anyway. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for joining us during the smoking session. If you did enjoy, please press that like and subscribe button for more content like this in the future. We have other reactions to the strokes as well as other artists you can check out if you like. Again, this was a suggestion. Thank you guys for the suggestions. You can let us know what else you'd like us to react to in the comments below. Uh, you can follow us on Twitter and Instagram. That'll pop up during the outro. You can subscribe to my commentary channel as well as our Twitch channel. That's in the description below. Uh, thank you guys so much for the love, the subs, the support, the suggestions. It's been great to see the channel continue to grow. We're uh, coming up on 550 fucking subscribers here soon. So, the next big goal is 750 and then a thousand. So once we hit a thousand, we can actually really start fucking taking this shit like even more seriously because then we'll actually be able to potentially get some shit monetized. So that'll be fucking nice. But yeah, it's been great to see everything just continue to go forth. And, and, and it's been a great ride with this fucking channel. We've had a couple peaks. It's been really wild to just see shit go up and down and up and down. But yeah, that's yeah, the fucking YouTube cool. life, I guess. Yeah, that's, it, it's cool. Like, in you know, obviously we want to, you know, maintain viewers for everything. And our personalities really carry, like, uh, the reactions. So Yeah, that's the yeah, goal. We're try I mean, that's the thing. Like, when I look back at, like, how cer a certain uh, YouTubers, where they start. Like, it's funny when you look at Mr. Beast. Like, he has stuff from seven years ago. Yeah. And then you see how he progresses, like, with his videos and how he changes it up, the method. Mm -hmm. But... Yeah, like, that's what we've been doing. We've been evolving since the day that we started doing this, and our personalities, I think, are starting to come out more, too, because once we got we got the lighting, we got the room, we got everything like that, so... Yeah, everything's set up now, so now we're it's, be more comfortable to fucking vibe yeah. out and shit. Yeah, know? now it's just about sitting there, you know, just being ourselves and... You know, kinda. yeah, we've got all the cameras. The only thing we can potentially do is set up different camera angles. So we're gonna figure out that sooner or later. But yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm yeah, I, you know, this this is a good track. Um, and uh, I'm gonna go stroke myself. Thank you for no, watching. God damn it! <laughs> More important thing is to enjoy this focus session. <laughs>
her a chance just to open up a newer car.